in our third example, a patient is prescribed 250 milligrams of a drug. What we've got is one gram in 10 milliliters. So if we write down the same three numbers, once got in, W is 250 milligrams, got is one gram, and in is 10 milliliters. W and G must both be in the same units. And here, G is in grams and W is in milligrams. So we convert the grams to milligrams. One gram is a thousand milligrams. Substituting in our formula again, want is 250, got is 1000, and in is 10. 10 times 250 is 2500, and 2500 divided by 1000 is 2.5 milliliters. So 2.5 millilitres of stock should be drawn up.